What's up everybody? I hope you are doing well on this very fine weekend to be alive. Today, we're gonna be talking a little bit about some of the lessons that we've learned from hair systems and how it directly applies into your life on a much, much larger scale. I always talk about how this channel, yeah, it's about hair loss, yeah, it's about hair systems, but really it's about being a better man. So these videos right here are a way to dredge those lessons up from what we've learned with hair systems and apply them into our larger life. And today it's gonna to be all about the opinions of others. Now there is no shortage of those out there, including myself in the past, that has been afraid of what others are going to think. Whether that's anything in life or specifically about the hair systems that we wear, right? Is this going to be the look that's perfect for me? Will other people like that? Will other people judge that I have a hair system? Will other people judge that I went from bald to having hair? Will other people care about this? Will they accept me? Will they still be my friend? These are the types of questions that a lot of us are asking ourselves as we embark on our hair system journey. And we are honestly exploring the different facets of adding this to our life. There is a identity shift going on here. And naturally, when there's an identity shift, we wonder, is that identity going to be accepted by those in and around us, right? Whether that's with our friends, with our family, with our coworkers, whether it's people that we see at the gym. We always wonder, right? Like if we make this change, is it going to positively or negatively affect what others think about us? And one of the things that I've tried to do over the past two years of really working on this channel and communicating with you is this. Stop focusing on what other people think. Focus on how you feel. Focus on if it makes you a better person. Focus on if it's something that you enjoy. Because when we can switch it from playing defense, what do other people think about me, to offense, I actually like this right here because it makes me feel better and I'm gonna keep on doing that. We're playing a completely different ball game. If you go on the offense and start claiming and owning the things inside of your life that you love, man, life changes dramatically. I spent most of my life worried about what other people were thinking about me. Was I smart enough? Was I attractive enough? Was I successful enough? I was constantly in a state of comparison because I cared about other people's opinions, cared about what they said, cared about what they thought. There's a time and a place for taking the advice from somebody. But that time and place, number one, is if first they are somebody that has walked the journey that you wanna walk and they've walked it successfully, and two, you need some help in that. You know where you wanna go and you need some help. If those aren't the conditions that are met when taking into consideration someone's opinions and or advice, then it's a non-starter. Oh, I forgot to mention, the third point there is they genuinely have to want to be someone that wants to help you, right? Not everybody wants to help you. A lot of people, they act like they're your friends. They're not really your friends. They don't want what's best for you. They don't, they would rather put either their will on top of you or even worse, they wanna keep you down as long as they're not elevating themselves. This is something that happens all the time and it's terrible, terrible to see. This is the type of behavior I actually see a lot inside of my YouTube comments and I've seen on, well, threads online about me. Now, I'm not saying, I'm just trying to be a better man every single day. That's what I'm trying to say. I'm trying to be better every single day and I experiment, I put out content and talk to you as much as I can, and I try to do it out of the bottom of my heart. That's about it. And there are those that have torn me through the ringer, said I'm the devil for exposing hair systems to the world, told me that I'm the devil because somehow I'm taking advantage of people because I'm, and I've said that I'm an expert and I'm not an expert. I've never said those words or anything. What I have said is I'm trying to help you be a better man and I'm sharing my story with hair loss and what I'm learning and the tips, the tricks, and all the, also the mental stuff. That's all I've said. But people will drag me through the mud. They will drag you through the mud. If you start improving your life, if you start working on the things that are going to make a difference inside of your life, if you come across someone with a fixed mindset, if you come across someone that your brightness exposes 
their inability or un lack of desire to change. Oh man, oh man, that is going to strike a nerve with them and they're gonna feel offended because your light is exposing their lack of action, their lack of ability to change. And that's something you gotta be ready for. So we see inside of hair systems, this just goes for the broader sphere of life. This is absolutely massive mindset shift right here. If we can go from playing defense, caring about what other people think, to putting our flag in the ground for what we stand for, what we want, what it is that's gonna make us a better person, man, life completely, completely changes. I beg and I urge you, stop playing defense, stop caring what other people, let alone other people on the internet, think about you. If you can make this change, I swear your life is gonna improve for the better. If you can do this, you're gonna find yourself getting more in phase with your soul. The things that you do, the people around you, your interests, the way you look, all of this stuff is going to come in alignment with who you truly are. And there is going to be no, there's gonna be no tension there. There's gonna be no discord there. It's not gonna be a cacophony of voices inside of your head. There's going to be alignment. And from alignment, you have clarity. And from clarity, you have focus. And from focus, that's when magic happens. I hope this type of stuff is really effective to you. Uh, if you like it, please drop me a little thumbs up, subscribe. I care about you and I care about us being better men every single day. Have a great one.